today we're going over Luke Skywalker Jedi Knight Galaxy of Adventures comparison with the older version and the newer version. We're going to check them both out today. I do want to give a shout out to Martin and Jesse, my co-workers. Uh, they gave me the idea to give one of these away. So I'm going to do that at the end of the video. Find out how you can win a Luke Skywalker, free shipping, everything. I'm just going to mail it straight to your house. So stay tuned for that at the end of the video. I uh, also want to give a shout out to Anakin Skywalker who left a comment on my Darth Vader Galaxy of Adventures video. Uh, he says, awesome, will you do Luke? So uh, I decided it would be a great time to do a giveaway. Uh, Darth Vader is my most popular video. So why not do Luke? Here we go. Let's check him out. Okay, we'll start with the old Galaxy of Adventures, uh, Luke. Again, this is a pretty cool YouTube channel. If you haven't checked it out, it's uh, Star Wars Kids on YouTube.com. But I got this one here uh, for a gift for my birthday from uh, Mike. You know who you are. Maybe you're watching, maybe you aren't. There's a comic book inside there. Uh, good old Luke with his uh, black glove. See, his lightsaber is pretty cool and definitely detailed. Uh, it's the Return of the Jedi blade, obviously. Uh, it's green, nice clear plastic there. Let's take a look at Luke Skywalker. Actually, uh, really good detail. He does have a kind of funny nose there, but excellent detail on Luke Skywalker. Jedi Knight. Again, these just have five points of articulation. You know, the arms just go up. Uh, his hands do spin around. And his head also has a little spin on there. Uh, bend up and down. Nope, no such bend. But this is how they were back in the 80s. So we can't complain. They were awesome. Uh, a lot of great detail on his jacket. Looks just like the film. Uh, his hand... Almost looks like a force choke or holding a pistol, but he doesn't come with a pistol. And then, of course, his cool uh, black glove, which is covering his mechanical hand. You can see his belt looks really good and highly detailed. No swivel in there. Little pockets that don't open, but... Uh, Definitely a beautiful figure, super high gloss on his pants. And of course he has the uh, old school peg. See Luke with the saber. Looks really good. Uh, I am gonna go over the comic. Luke Skywalker, just show you the pictures here. And if you wanna read it, you can feel free to pause it and read it. But definitely looks cool. Looks like they're going to show us the final battle here from Return of the Jedi. Uh, that free giveaway for Luke Skywalker, it is going to be a trivia question from Return of the Jedi. So you'll have to stay tuned for that. Again, it's going to be free shipping. It isn't going to cost you a dime. So, this is where Luke was about to turn to the dark side and decides to change his mind. Palpatine looks really cool. Again, if you guys haven't seen the YouTube videos, uh, they're really cool. Definitely check them out. And these new figures are designed to uh, get people in the new market. Alright, so we've checked out the old school Luke. Check out the new Galaxy of Adventures, Luke. Uh, this one has a very anime look to him. The box is very simple. You can see Chewbacca, Darth Vader, Rey, and Finn on the side. Cool box art on the back. Uh, there is no bio, but most kids, you know, they aren't really going to read the bio anyway. He looks like he comes with a cool lightsaber slash. Uh, I will compare him next to Darth Vader. So we can get a cool close-up of that, but let's get Luke out of the box. Okay, let's take a look at Luke's lightsaber. Uh, again, it's his iconic green lightsaber from Return of the Jedi. 
looking good compared to loose of the lightsaber. Let's take a look at Luke. Luke looks really good. Definitely an anime style going on there. Uh, a lot of love went in this. Again, and uh, it's like a soft rubber over the top here. Um, I think that might even come off, which is pretty cool. Uh, he does have a belt. Looks like something is going on here. I'll check that out in a minute. And he has some cool shiny boots. Let's check out some articulation. That's about as high as Luke's gonna get because his hair uh, is looking back. He looks down about that far. He looks this way. He looks that way. And he does a full 360. But overall, the head uh, looks really cool. He can question you. Uh, arms. They do have like a little hinge in there but they do rotate 360. Uh, both arms have like some sort of pull on them. So let me put them back where I had them the first time. But that's gonna be for his four slash. We'll check that out here in a minute. Didn't mean to four slash the camera there. Uh, his legs do have like a little ball. Uh, well, it's not a ball, it's like a uh, hinge in there. He does do the splits pretty good, if you need him to. His knees have one little bend in there. You can see the bend. Uh, his feet bend, and they do swivel like uh, the Belt Black Series, which is good. So you can probably position Luke really well. His arms have a nice bend that go up to there uh of course his arms do go all the way out and if you feel inclined you can even turn them up let's see how easy he holds his lightsaber looks like you can either slide it in or snap it on we're going to try to snap ours on it snaps on nicely uh we're going to try to get luke to hold it with both hands. All right, now, we have Luke holding the saber in both hands. Uh, on the box, it says to do the four slash. So you just pull his arms down. And it's just like that. So, that's your Four slash. Still pretty cool. Doesn't want to work every time, but oh yeah, there you go. Okay, here we have Luke and Vader together from Galaxy of Adventures. And you can see uh, Vader has his four slash. Uh, I think it goes this way, yeah. He twists like so. And Vader stands really well and pretty high next to Luke. I actually have Luke doing the splits there. Uh, but Luke stands up really good next to Vader also. So you can see the two of them together would actually be great for kids. But Pretty cool. Definitely a big difference between this Luke and this Luke. What do you guys think? Well, let's be fair. Definitely, they're both, you know, in their own um, overall really cool. But let's see if Luke's little jacket comes off. Looks like this just, oh yeah, little button pops off there. And this 
vest will come off. Oh, this looks really cool underneath. Okay, trying to get this off is actually uh, pretty hard, but it's probably easier if you just pop his head off because when I try to get it off, his head actually came off. So let's see how easy this is supposed to be to get back on. Because, you know, uh, a kid will be crying <laughs> and screaming. But oh, let me try. So to get this vest on and off, the best thing to do is just pop his head right off. And then this uh, arm is going to go in underneath. So that's actually way easier that way. But getting, uh, yeah, so that comes on and off really easy uh, and great. And then this little ball is going to pop in on the head and it just goes a little pop and it's already on there. So really good. Really good. Uh oh, what happened here? So I guess all of uh, the... <laughs> All of the balls um, just pop right in. So, but still good. Uh, it's like a flat paint, but there is a little bump that comes up on there. We'll stand them next to Vader. Looks really good. I'll put his saber on so you guys can check it out that way. We got the four slash with one hand. We have four slash with the other hand. Holding the blade. And then again with both. That looks pretty cool. Cool. Do a few more poses for you guys. You will turn to the dark side. Awesome little view there. Uh, have Vader go in for the the final duel. Really cool. Let's have Luke do his four slash. All right, for the win. Okay, it's time for the giveaway. All you have to do is throw a like on the video and leave a comment below and answer this question. In Return of the Jedi, what is the name of the monster that Jabba the Hutt tries to feed Luke to? Uh, that's the monster that Jabba tries to feed Luke to. What's the name of that monster? Leave the comment down below, throw a like on the video, and I will see you guys in the next one.